Xiangou Zoological Garden receives over 500 visitors on weekdays and around 1,500 visitors in weekend. Recently, zoo officials have cut off public feeding to animals in the zoological garden. Sarah Wei finds out why. Authorities from the Yangon Zoological Garden stopped the permission for animal food stores inside the garden since early this month in order to extend the public area and to protect the animal. Officials closed 10 animal food stores in the garden and admitted they faced serious health issues of animals because of the public feeding previously. As we are living in the urban area, sometimes people just feed the animals with food like jelly. And even though it is fruits of vegetable, it was used with chemical fertilizers to grow. So as a result, it harms the health of the animals, especially their stomach and liver, and we have scheduled to feed them. Outside foods for animals are restricted, but there are a couple of exceptions. Most Myanmar people have spiritual belief about feeding animals. These requests can be taken to zoo officials. If in this kind of situation, they can come to see the officials in administration office and we will check the food and only if it is okay to feed the animals, we will allow them to feed the animals. Local visitors also agree to this move. For us humans, we also have to take care of what we eat every time, so I think it is necessary and it can protect the health issue of the animals. According to the latest study states, Tiangong Zoological Garden has 46 mammals and 69 bat species and 18 reptile species, altogether 1,300 animals. Sarah Wei for MITV, Myanmar International Television.